Hi guys, good old times, to our immortals out there. Welcome back to Infinity Complex Palace of the Immortals. I am Chris. Uh, I'm doing something a little different today. I'm going to paint this little guy. I kind of, uh, I've had him around for a while and I like to paint my little toys sometimes when I get them. I had a raptor somewhere that I repainted. I don't know. Anyway, I, I like to paint miniatures and stuff for D&D &D, and that got me into painting like little mini, like not just miniatures for D&D, &D, but little toys like this. One example, give me, just give me a second. Oh, come on, come on. Okay. You guys may have seen this guy on the Discord before. He's not my best work, but I am rather proud of how he turned out. I like this guy. He's a beholder from D&D. &D. Let's get him a little bit closer to the camera here so you can really get that detail. So... The D and D tail, yeah. So, I'm gonna use the same paints on this guy today. Now, I'm not sure how well the oops, sorry, I'm not sure how well the paints are gonna stick because this is not the same type of plastic as the miniatures. Every time I paint one of these little toys, it it's variable on how well the paint's gonna work. So I may have to overall apply some layer after layer to get it to stick, but. We're gonna go ahead and give it a shot. Are you gonna be up on your phone like that the whole time? No, I'm trying to, not trying to be, I'm trying to, I'm trying to remember not to look at the camera. Thank you. Yeah. Um, I'm just also trying to make sure I'm in good. the shot. Yeah, your hands are good. They're in a good space and um, the sound is good. Okay. I'm like, so I'm coming through pretty clean here? Yeah. All yeah. Right, when cool, you were cool. way over there, you still sounded good. So yeah. I figured you'd sound good sitting normal. awesome leah's leah's giving me some information about how this looks because or how this is coming through audio wise because you guys yeah, can't hear me i'm also gonna be paying attention to your comments for you while i listen to my podcast so oh thanks you don't have to do that but i appreciate it well you so, can't look at him um we are going to be pa repainting this guy you can see he's a little dirty he's old he's dirty he's even got a little chip missing from where he's taken some damage i think that'll actually add to it yeah because he's it's supposed to be all that but um, I was going to paint his pipe green, but then I was like, I don't know if I wanted to go green or purple, so I asked Gamgee, and Gamgee green. picked it's purple. Green. Or not green, yellow. Yellow or purple, and then I was like, the yellow is a good color, because it'll go with all the browns and skeleton bone I intend on putting. But the purple would also go really well. Yeah. Yellow and brown, yellow and brown and purple and brown are both pretty good combi color combinations, as proven by the Zerg and Starcraft. So, I was like, you know what? And I asked Gamgee, Gamgee said go with purple. I wasn't gonna go with, I was gonna go with a lighter purple, potentially. I asked him again, lighter or darker? He chose darker, so we're going with this nice alien purple, which should look a little bit like this. I'm Ooh, gonna put some on the paper. it might turn brown once you put it on the green. Huh? It might turn brown once you put it on the green. Oh, I'm gonna, it's, it's not gonna, this isn't paint, this is just plastic. All right, yeah. So it's not gonna blend. It should turn a purple like this. I'm gonna put some on the paper right around this area yeah this that'll work. area that area that'll work babe you can stop looking at it i had to I'm see it, at it. that's <laughs> perfect right around that area so that i can see what i'm doing and i'm going to try to keep my paints on the camera in the camera at range they're in the camera so you can see how many i'm using <clears throat> but um i'm going to keep i'm going to keep looking at it i know i am because i'm so stupid so we're going to go ahead and give this a shot i don't know judge me judge me not uh, no, I'm, I the pipe is going to be purple. Idea. We are going to be using a combination of skeleton bone and desert yellow. To create the um, bony color for our guy here. Uh, what else? Uh, I'm going to incorporate either greedy or bright gold into this somewhere along the lines. Uh, one of the things I like to do with all my miniatures is put metallics in them because I like metal and gemstones. I am kind of a uh, greedy in that regard. Yeah, like a magpie. Uh, we're going to use oak brown and maybe some desert yellow itself to create the, uh, to do the leaves. We're going to use the same pattern that's on the leaves, but 
And then I've got ash gray and castle gray here in case we need it for anything. I'm gonna use straight up oak brown for the lips. I'm gonna use, I need yellow. I didn't grab an actual yellow. Hmm. Look at that, all that work and I wasn't prepared. Here we go. No, I think that's too yellow. Moon dust. Here we go. I'm gonna use a little bit of moon dust and skeleton bone to create some yellowing or yellowed teeth for our guy and paint the inside of his mouth uh, more of the skeletal colors, maybe a little bit darker for the uh, because it's in his mouth. I am not a professional. I am not super talented at this. I am not what you would call good. I like to do this for fun. So if you, I'm doing something wrong, I don't care. I like to do this and I'm gonna end up learning things as I go. So it's just what I do. Uh, if you have any tips, I'm more than happy to hear them. And I will take them into account later. Fifth Row said, ooh. Ooh, Fifth Row says. Well, I guess this is going to go well. Well, Fifth Row is the art guy, so he's going to love this. Yeah, so I'm going to start off by um, painting my lips. <laughs> uh, the reason I'm going to start off by painting or with painting the lips is because, um, yeah, I'm going to start off by painting the lips because I want to make sure any extraneous color that overlaps here and in here and in here, when it dries, I can cover it up with some of my other old paints. Nope, that's not what I'm going to do. That's stupid because that's, I'm just going to have to be more careful when I put it on. That's all. I have to sit closer to the table because I'm too far back. All right, so let's, I'm like trying to figure out how to do this because I'm like, okay, where am I going to go? Let's just, just breathe, figure your shit out, Chris. Just start. Just pick a I, place it's my start. It's my legs, okay? I can't figure my legs out. My legs feel weird. Okay. Oh, this feels weird. <laughs> just sitting normally. Okay, that's that's not bad, but it, this uh, honestly, this it's is kind of in my way. Person live stream, yeah, it, it, this is a live stream. Yeah, this is a live stream. The uh, the the light is in my way. I should have put it over here because I'm freaking. But you're right-handed. Because I'm right-handed, I'm I'm gonna be uh. doing this. So. <sighs> well, it's too late now. Is it? Figure it out. One moment. Try not to show our entire everything when you move it. That works. He's just covering the camera right now. Because I'm in the camera right now. Because that part is kind of dirty. <laughs> Alright, I'll tell you. Oh yeah, I guess you can figure it out on your own. <laughs> that doesn't look too bad. Oh my god, that's so much better. <laughs> I feel like the light's a little darker on the other side now, but yeah, that'll work. Yeah, there we go. That's so much better. Like, in terms of comfort for me, and... Is my how my hands? Uh, Still hands. there, yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. So we're gonna go with a little desert yellow and skeleton bone, as I've said before, and we're gonna just start off by doing the main body. So for this, I'm going to now my paints are old. I haven't used them in a while, so they may be a little dry, but. I feel like the way you had it set up before was different because I could see everything and now all I can see is this little, little, little tiny bit. Really? It's upside down. Oh. And now it's doing something else. Yeah, now there's something in front of the screen. What? Now I can't see anything. 
What the? We're trying to figure it out, Fethero. All right, I'm going to have to start over. <laughs>